The recent rise in tensions between the U.S. and Denmark has sparked a discussion of what could happen if the U.S. pulled a plug on cloud services for us. Could something like this happen, or am I paranoid? I mean, theoretically speaking, anything could happen. It comes down to what do you think the probability of that is? How likely do you think it'll happen? I'm not in the business of guessing that kind of thing. I just lay it out at management's feet and I say, okay, here's something that could theoretically happen. Theoretically, a cloud provider could go completely down. Theoretically, a cloud provider could be completely unavailable. How much do you want to invest in solving that problem for when it may eventually happen? And it helps to keep it into perspective that you're probably not going to be the world's largest concern if Amazon is suddenly unavailable in your country. If Amazon or Azure or Google or all three is suddenly unavailable in your country, think about everything else that's going to have problems. Banking, uh, electric utilities, all kinds of stuff will suddenly become unavailable and will cause all kinds of problems. If your company falls into those categories, hospitals are a great example. If life-saving, uh, and 9-11 services are another one, if uh, life-saving measures would suddenly become unavailable in the event that your hosting partner was unavailable, then most companies in that kind of situation, they are already used to doing disaster planning and they build a second data center, or they have on-premises stuff, they have things that they can go put their fingers on, they worry about what happens in the event of a natural disaster, taking out their internet connectivity, all that kind of thing. But if your Billy Bob's bait and tackle and gun shop, as Aaron Bertrand would say, are you that worried about it? Probably not. You probably just want to get off cloud backups, and that's probably about it. And in the event that you lost a total cloud, because after all, too, you're going to see this stuff coming. You know, you see, like right now, U.S. and Denmark relations are a little janky. If it started to significantly escalate, you would see that coming months in advance, as we do now, and you could gradually start making preparations that the business was uh, comfortable with. Just on a related note, I mean, I've, I've seen through LinkedIn uh, just a complete decimation of folks working for uh, federal contractors. I would be more worried about your career in this day and age. Uh, career is the wrong word, job. Job is the word that I'm looking for, your current position that you're currently at. Um, that if you're working for a federal contractor, uh, something that is dependent on trade, that, you, that there's never been a better time to start passively looking for work. Uh, to start taking interviews amongst your friends, say, hey, just I want to be aware.